Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to Gold Pass Clash. Today's day 78. It's been a few days, so thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you for your patience while I was away out of town. The new Gold Pass is here, and of course, I've already collected this lovely Warden skin. Uh, it was over here on this little pillar here, and I don't know where to find it. Um, I don't have a Warden. I'm a Town Hall 10, so uh, eventually we'll be able to see that skin a little bit closer up. But yes, I bought the Gold Pass. It's the new season. It's April. Um, we're celebrating with baby blue because of Easter, you know, we got the pastel theme and whatnot. And I've got max storages from the, the gold pass season bank and I have nowhere to put that loot. So we're just gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna attack for fun. We're gonna attack for trophies and showcasing these armies. I now have, by the way, this is huge max that army camps at town all 10. So now I've got the, the proper army composition, which is supposed to be simple, right? It's two golems, 10 witches, 10 bowlers. And then of course we got all the spells. I've got my jump spell upgraded by the way. So this thing, this thing lasts for 60 seconds or 59, I think seconds. Um, and I've got something really exciting happening in the lab. So if you guys know of any really good bat spell armies, please post them down below in the comments. Obviously, I've got two builders working on the heroes, and they're going to be done later today and tomorrow. And then, of course, the other three are working on air defenses. So I'm super vulnerable to air attacks right now. But then once those are done, so I've got one, two, and three, right? And the fourth one is actually already maxed out, so I don't have to worry about that one. But once those are all done in the next two or three days, then we're going to be super protected against air attacks. And actually, I'm curious. Yeah, look at that. The last defense I took was Valkyries, actually. And, of course, they're going to win because I haven't upgraded a lot of like ground defenses and whatnot, but you'll notice like the past three attacks have all been ground attacks because I'm actually protecting air pretty well. So we're, we're working toward <laughs> upgrading defenses and that goes in. Let me go ahead and start looking for a base while I talk. Um, I am very, wow. Look at all that loot. I'm going to attack this base for the loot, even though I can't take any because the season bank maxed out my storages, but that brings me to the question of what about the, um, rushing question right i asked you guys in the last video and in the last poll in the community tab by the way many of you voted many of you didn't so go vote in the community tab it's not too late to uh to, to determine as a community whether or not we should rush again now i am leaning towards no because it would just be horrible but you know it is what it is sometimes you just got to do what you got to do so um because i've got max season loot uh for and i will have that for a very long time you know, the temptation is rush again, but I'm just kind of not feeling it. I'm just feeling it. I'm feeling it um, in more of a like a let's be patient type type way. So I'm just, uh, I don't know. It, it's weird, man. It's a weird place to be where I can't spend any loot, but I'm so far, far away from maxed out tunnel 10 that I've decided, you know what? I'm just going to bear it. I'm going to bear it and, um, and not have uh, a town hall 11 just yet. We're not ready for that. We're definitely not ready for that. And, and generally speaking, my way is upgrade the town hall once i um especially in this situation where i've got maxed out storages where i can't spend two of the three resources right so once i'm done with the elixir which i'm very close to done with the elixir already but once i'm done with the elixir including the lab once i'm done with dark elixir including the heroes in the lab then i'll probably want to move on to town hall 11 even if my defenses aren't maxed out that's just i think that's the way this season needs to go i'm far too far away from maxed out town hall 10 to go to town hall 11 it would just be terrible so but you can still vote because right now i think it's like 60 40 yes to no something like that that's not a strong enough majority for me to like to change my mind but you guys may if you if you think strongly yes you should definitely go to town hall 11 right now go vote in that poll in the community tab i'll share a link in the description but there we go three star i just wanted to showcase this army some more guys and with maxed out army camps notice i got those maxed out army camps i got full i've got a 2 10 10 right two golems 10 witches 10 bowlers it is beautiful so i've requested for cc troops and i'm going to go now and collect on an achievement that i got off camera over the weekend of course we had raid weekend i've been doing a lot of that lately i was actually the number one account in the clan somehow with twenty seven thousand points so shout out to those hog riders right and the uh the graveyard spells that's what i'm using you've seen it before in this series but i have now looted 250,000 capital gold during raid attacks and i get 100 free gems that is fantastic so we've collected that that is absolutely beautiful now i'm going to well you know while i wait for cc let's actually go over to builder base i've got some cool stuff going on there i've got lots of loot um i am currently upgrading the baby dragons in the lab which i will do one more time to max them out and then work on the uh the uh battle rams if i still have to you never i don't know what when the update's going live and i don't know what it's going to do so i'm just going to keep on keeping on with the program until then i'm not rushing super heavily by the way 
with BuilderBase because I figured they would try to balance things out. A lot of people were just rushing BuilderBase to get the uh, the sixth builder. And I get that. And I don't blame anybody for doing that. But I kind of figured something was coming. And so I wanted to play this game a little more balanced. So what I'm basically doing with BuilderBase is once I'm done with the Elixir based upgrades, except for the lab, I, I've not upgraded stuff I don't use, obviously, but I am upgrading baby dragons and battle rams, but or, or whatever this thing's called. I forget the names of these troops because there's too many in the main village and builder base combined. It's just too much. So, and in clan capital, there's too, just too many. But anyway, um, <laughs> I'm going through until I finish with the Elixir and then I upgrade the builder hall. So, builder hall seven right now. Uh, battle machine's going to level 13 very, very soon. And it's good i think i saw that eater i uh, y-d-e-r sent me the cc troops i'm not entirely sure thank you so much for donating cc troops to me guys and if you guys want to join my clan and donate cc troops during videos and get shout outs then uh join my clan you can find the link to the discord server where you must apply or follow the instructions to join the clan link for that is also down below in the description and if you want a uh a shout out in the next video as well then do send me a super thanks with the heart button and the dollar sign next to the like button and while you're down there hit the like button Help us out with that algorithm. So last video, I said I was going out of town. And then likely that would also be the last video for a while with face cam. And that's because I'm going to be doing some construction in my office. Now, we just got home last night, very late. And I slept in this morning. That's why today's video is late. But construction begins in my office today after I film this video. So that means that next time you see me, you won't actually see me. It's going to be a face cam-less video um, unless I just can set up something that looks relatively decent even in construction which is not likely so bear with me for the next few days maybe week maybe two i don't know how long this is going to take going to do some work in the office no face cam and then we will have a whole new orientation in the office it's going to be really awesome so just a just a heads up about that and once again i'm just going to mention this again okay if you know a bat spell army at town hall 10 that's really good please share it with me in the comments because i don't know anything about the bat spell literally nothing so help me out okay oh and i just remembered okay so comment question of the day we're gonna uh, put a pause on that because near the beginning of using comment question of the day in every video we were getting like 100 or more questions a video and then near the end of march it was only getting like a dozen or less per video so i think that 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 maybe has run its course so we're gonna take a break from comment question of the day all right so let's <clears throat> smack this base because it's a town of 10 and i feel like it so let's go um i'm gonna come in from the single inferno here so let's come in uh left and right couple of witches couple of witches line up the rest of them wall wrecker and then bowlers right across the way just like so okay so that should be perfect um let's drop a rage and a heal. I'm also going to put another rage and another heal just, just to get ahead of the game here. Let's freeze the Inferno Tower. All right. And then I'm also going to, yeah, let's go ahead and poison. I just got an achievement. Firefighter. That's good. Th those That's good uh, Good uh, gem counts. Right? They have really good rewards for the firefighter achievements. But okay. So, um, oh, I should you know what? I probably should have put a rage and a heal in the middle. I think I put my, my spells a little bit early because this multi-inferno is just going to absolutely melt my bowlers. So not good. We just lost a lot of the firepower in the middle of the space that could have given us a three star. So I'm not expecting a three star, but you guys have heard me say that before and we still three starred so well. So, and, and I'm not using heroes, by the way, notice that notice there's no heroes. They're upgrading. They're going to be upgrading for like the rest of April, right? Actually, they're probably going to be upgrading for the rest of the entire year, to be honest with you. But, um, but, but still th this army is insanely powerful. And I know all of you know about it, but if, if there is a few of you that don't know or are afraid to use it or whatever look at what i'm doing with it without heroes it's stupid we just three-starred again just crazy and i've got a, like a whole skeleton army still alive it's, it's oh man it's great and i just realized you know i mentioned something to the effect of um i want a trophy push with these next two armies and then i forgot to look at the trophy count so i only got 19 but it was still decent right Got an additional star bonus, so got more loot in the treasury. I'm worried I'm going to max out this treasury soon, okay? It's it's going to happen, which is not the worst thing in the world. I mean, I've got maxed out storage. So I'm thinking what I'm going to do, actually, is, um, ooh, I'm going to find a, a base out there that I can, that's maybe more compressed, and I'll share with you in the next video, and put my elixir storages on the outside. And then you guys can come find me. I'm at, right now, 21, 25 trophies. If you want some loot, free loot, then come come get some. <laughs> 
So back to the progress base, guys. All offense buildings are done. We're working on heroes and lab. That's pretty much it for offense. I've got loads and loads of traps. I finished off the army camps. Or, I'm sorry. Yeah, well, I have finished off the army camps, but it's the air defenses that are done now. They're all working up here. And yeah, we're just working toward maxing out defenses. I'll probably need to reorganize this a little bit. I want to get um, my ultimate defense guide and update it. I'll probably make a video about that. That way I know, because I am a bit defensively rushed, what I need to do next to make the base more powerful. Now, I did get the firefighter achievement. Let me go ahead and collect that. 250 Inferno Towers for 200 gems, dude. We got 300 free gems today. That's amazing. Oh, yeah. That is beautiful. That is beautiful. Wow. Okay. Um, We're getting lots of gems. And I, I don't use them unless I absolutely need to, because they kind of like save my booty when I need it to when I need my booty saved. So um, things like, you know, a builder is going to finish at 3 a.m. that night. I'll go ahead and just gem it right before bed and then start a new upgrade. That's whenever I don't quite math things properly. Um, so that's when I use my gems and we'll see if there's ever another opportunity. How do you guys use your gems? Let me know in the comments, actually. I'm really interested in, in reading those comments. So that's pretty much all I have for today, guys. Um, it was a solid day for sure. Ooh, I just got some more stuff. Power potion. I'll claim that. And I've also got maxed out wall rings. And I've got max walls. Oh my gosh, dude, it's it's insane. We're, we're we're three months in. Why was I blurry? Have I been blurry this whole time? I'm not blurry right now. Stop it, webcam. Stop it. <laughs> anyway, we're three months in, starting the fourth month, and I don't know. It just feels like this is crazy overpowered. It, let me know your thoughts in the comments in the gold pass. It's insane. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you all next time.